Welcome to episode 1 of our Saga Spirit of Adventure cruise vlog series. If you're new to our channel and you enjoy this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Right then, so right now. another adventure starts Paulie Morgan, isn't it? Yes, indeed. So we've just gone through check-in, we came down on the, in the taxi, which was all very civilised, wasn't it Paulie? Yeah, yeah. Um, and we got through and it was a different testing system, wasn't it? Uh, with Sargi, because we sat in the taxi, but it was slightly different than it was with previous. But actually, it was just as swift, wasn't it? Yeah, they they do the test and then they give you the test back in a little uh, envelope. Yeah. Rather than them, rather than them sending the results through. Yeah. You actually go to a yeah, next place it. and then they check the results. Yeah. So it all yeah all worked. So. Yeah. Yeah. So not too painful at all. Um, we had to fill in a paper questionnaire, which we haven't done before. We used to do it electronically, but we expected that, didn't we? Yeah. So yes. So we're off to the ship now, um, so, and this is the sign the that we sign always we love, love to see. see. Yeah. So we can't wait to get on board Saga, Spirit Adventure, and uh, eat. Yeah, <laughs> eat, drink, and be merry. There she is. Look. She's only small, isn't she, Paulie? 999 passengers. So I'm not sure it's going to be full capacity or not, but we'll soon find out. Um, but we're really looking forward to our first Saga experience. We've had dealings with them, haven't we, with the name and seminars and stuff, and we've always been impressed. So we're hoping that um, booking this cruise will see exactly what it's like to yes. cruise with them, Saga, and show you what it's like too. Because um, we get a lot of questions, don't, you, don't we, about Saga? And obviously, are we old enough? Because you have to be over 50, but oh, yeah. ah, but we are. So um, here we go, boarding, boarding. Hello, Hello there. Hi, right? Thank you. Ready then, boarding? We're getting on. <laughs> We're getting on. <laughs> Cruise number 29, isn't it, Paul? Indeed. Yeah, 29th cruise. So, uh, And most of the time, there's that strange bloke following us on a scooter. Yeah, can you see him? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome on board, Sunny Thanks. Are you... We're together. Well, but I'm with them. Yeah, we're all here. Thanks, sir. Thank you. <laughs> all right, follow me. Follow me. <laughs> with you? Yes. Lovely. Welcome aboard. Thank you very much. You don't mind if I'm filming? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello there. Hello. Hello. Come and join us tomorrow, 1.30 at the fitness. Thank you. No problem. You wanted to go to the spa. Will you all fit in? Thank you. Mm. Eight, five, two. Oh, I thought that's not ours. <laughs> <laughs> maybe when I've had, maybe when I've had a few drinks, I might need yeah. that. But. Yeah, we have uh, we open in the grill by deck twelve. Okay. Just one deck out. Okay, and there's open for food now, is it? Yeah. Okay, lovely. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Right, so we are in our cabin. Well, actually, it's not a cabin because it's so exciting. We are on the Saga Spirit Adventure and we are having our first proper sweet experience, aren't we, Paulie? Is that I just thought? <laughs> I just yes. I just thought that the room was really rubbish because we only if you turn the camera I know, but look. Then you've got a bed. <laughs> I know. So come in with so, we've got all one. this hang on Polly, this is exciting look. This is all compliment I'm so excited it's I can't really speak. And we've got a fridge that we've not normally it's normally empty, isn't it? Yeah. Paul? But yes, the only so, trouble is it's one of those cabins has got an adjoining door. So I don't know. We'll have to see what the next. We've got bubbly and canopies. Open the lid, Paulie, open the lid. Oh, look at that. That's posh canopies, isn't it? Should we, should we see if the neighbours are here? So, we're popping and see the neighbours. No, oh, this is our bedroom. <laughs> Woo! Oh, we've been so looking forward to this, haven't we, Paulie? Um, oh, I feel a bit of mosh. A bit of mosh. I wonder where, where's this door go? What's that? Oh, What's that in there? 
It's a bag. It's a bag of stuff. A bag of stuff. Bag of stuff. Well, especially doing a room tour and you're oh. rooting through bags of stuff. Oh, it's sanitizer and yes, to keep everyone safe. That's lovely. So. And this is our other neighbours through here. So we see what they're like. We've got a walk-in wardrobe. Woohoo! Yeah. And it's safe. Yeah. Oh my God. And there's another door here. <laughs> I don't know where this goes. Uh, and we've got a bathroom with a proper bath. This is just um. But well, we always say about um. Is the shower big enough, Paulie? We always say about shower. I mean, I prefer a shower curtain myself. <laughs> no, you do not. <laughs> yes. So yes. Yeah, so we're having our um sweet experience in Saga of Adventure. We've just met our butler, aren't we, Paul? Called Darwin. We've got a butler. By the way, it's called Spirit of Adventure, not, sa not Saga of Adventure. <laughs> okay. We've got another toilet here, look. Well, not another oh, one. Another this one. And then we're back where we started. <laughs> Ooh. So, um, yes, we've just met our butler. We've never had a butler, have we, Paul? We haven't. A butler called Darwin, um, who was lovely. Uh, and also, we've just seen Patrick as well, who's our cabin steward. <sighs> Didn't give me the choice of one or another then. Do you want that one? No. <laughs> they look rather special, don't they? Mm. But I want to show you this. Well, we've got a bottle of bubbly. We've got two TVs. <laughs> Paul's going to be in heaven. But look at this. I know we're cruising in November um, across the English Channel and we probably won't get a lot of time. Well, the weather, well, who knows, isn't it? But look at our balcony. This is just amazing. And look at that there. Oh, I'm so happy. We're just about, well, we're, it's, the nights are drawing in, as you can see. It's only just uh, before five and we've... Um, Oi, oh, you're off. <laughs> We've got two doors. <laughs> I don't know if you can see there, there's Queen Elizabeth there, which we're going on again before Christmas. And the little Aurora p &O, over there. It's not quite in service yet. But yes, we're still in Southampton. Um, we're just going to eat our canopies and maybe open our bottle of bubbly and then um, get to know our sweet, sweet, our sweet. Sweet, sweet. So, um, yes. And our case is already here, so we'll get unpacked and sorted. So, Paul has just opened the bubbly. Balfour. We know this is nice because we've had we it. We've got, um, I've got to be honest, I'm not a big fan of yes. the nice sparkly stuff, but this is. Um, so, cheers. Delicious. Cheers, all. Cheers, Saga. Here's for a good five nights. Um, if this is uh, the start, honey, hopefully onwards and outwards. Well, I don't think you can get upwards, can you really? Unless, unless the ship's got wings. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we haven't been drinking yet. Cheers! Mm. Proper crystal glass is pouring mm -hmm. too. <gasps> We're being spoiled. Mm, looks like all the... No, I only had the other one, wow. two, and I left you that one. There was four so there. it looked like meaty. There was four there when I left. Mm, they're lovely. Have we got a fruit bowl? I just have some grapes. Oh. Cheese and fish, I think. No, it's not. I am a connoisseur of fine dining. <laughs> right then, so we just got called to do muster. We had an announcement to go say, watch the, the um, safety video on the TV, which we did, and all go to muster. So we had to go down to deck. Six. Six, and we're on deck 11. 11. No one allowed in the lift unless you've got mobility issues, so... Um, no, unless you're on a mobility scooter. No, they were, they were letting a few people in that mm. had pushers and stuff. Okay. Um, so, but what that meant was everyone's going down the stairwell. So all the social distancing sort of went out the window and there's, you know, we're on a saga ship, so it's over 50, and a lot of the um, passengers are older than us. I know. <laughs> yes, I know you can't believe we're on Saga. <laughs> but the man in front of me, oh, bless he him. was um, ninety-four. Um, he was God's older brother. <laughs> no, he wasn't. <laughs> but he was struggling, so he was walking down the, the stairs with his son. But our, our point is, we got there. They scanned our card. Thank you very much for coming. Walk around. Now you've got to go back to back your cabin the until there's an announcement to say that everything's open again. So that's 
We, uh, I mean, we're, we're at a brass now because we're seriously well, unfit, but we're in our 50s. This man in front of us... Well, he couldn't walk any further, so they let him further. sit, but you couldn't sit in the areas, could you? So, this man who's... He ain't going to see 80 again, definitely. It was 94. Was 94. I was 94. Oh, there you go. Like, no, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. He's 94. <laughs> and he's just had to walk 10 flights of stairs. Yes. So, so that's not right. No. Um, however, it was, you know, when we got there, but we had to walk back up. We're now back in our suite. Sweet. Ah! And we've just opened our bottle of vodka. And we had some Diet Pepsi. And we're just going to have a... A vodka Diet Coke, aren't we? Well, not Coke, Diet Pepsi. And Paul's got some snacks. What are they, Paul? Oh, hang on, it says on here, um, uh, once opened, not for sharing, especially the girls. <laughs> Sorry, what mate. What is it? I don't make the rules. Savory, let me just show you. Savory, Savory cheese biscuits. Um. So I'm sure Paul's gonna now sample one. But this one says on the back, not for sharing with girls. Are they nice? All right. Pauline! <laughs> ah, let me try one. Mmm. Now, everybody who keeps saying, oh, Paul, you're really mean to Carol, mm. I just gave her a, a biscuit, right? Because <laughs> she's yeah. been good. <laughs> Mate, that's not right, is it? Mm. I don't think I can be seeing um, many more. Comments down below about what I just <laughs> No. I have a feeling I'm not so, going to like it. <laughs> we are um, just going to enjoy a drink in our suite. Did I tell you we were staying in a suite? <laughs> you had a message, Ooh, mate. Oh, hang on. Oh, we, we might be allowed be... out. A very good evening again, everyone. This is Captain Darren speaking from the Navigational Bridge. First, a, uh, again, a very warm welcome to all of you aboard this beautiful ship, Spirit of Adventure, on a uh, five day cruise, Continental Express. Or escape. <laughs> Express. Be, uh, He's, even he doesn't know. He's driving. <laughs> in store for us, uh, starting with our sea day tomorrow. Our drill is concluded, and I really appreciate your participation. Right now, we are just uh, completing our pre-departure checks on the bridge here, and we should be singling up shortly, and uh, we'll be getting off the pier here at, uh, in 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. And the plan for departure tonight is. Just gonna come off the pier. We're gonna make a uh, swing to port, turn the ship around 180 degrees, and then we'll be uh, off and running from the port of Southampton. It's about a two hour run until the outer reaches where we will drop our local pilot. That's just up by uh, Portsmouth. And uh, from Which there, we'll head out again. into the English Channel. Initially, we're gonna head west because it's, it's not a huge distance I'm in. So we'll just add a little distance and then uh, early tomorrow morning we'll be making the turn to the south across the lanes and then heading east towards Imune and Swarm. So without further ado, uh, have a wonderful first evening. Please uh, get settled. If there's any questions, please ask our crew. They're here to help you with that process and I'll now turn things over to our very vibrant Cruise Director Johnny for a little breakdown on today's oh, events. Johnny. Thank you Here's very much, Johnny. Captain Darren, as <laughs> always. And we'll welcome on board from myself, ladies and gentlemen, wherever you have travelled from. I certainly hope you've had a nice relaxing day thus far. It's only going to get better. And yes. as uh, Captain Darren said, yes, a nice relaxing day at sea tomorrow. In fact, because we've only got one sea day, we have got so much to pack in for each and every one of you. You will hopefully be sport for choice. And as I always say, you can do as much or indeed as little as you want to forward. And as it's a nice sea day tomorrow, we can stay up as late as we yes. want. Yes, yes. I want to stay up till half past All ten. welcome on board to our fabulous new party band as well, the Britannia Band. You can um, get up close and personal with those a little bit later on. on one. Mm. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'll leave you in peace now. If you're off to dine very shortly, bon appetit. And I certainly hope that I'll see many of you in the home of all your live entertainment. That is the Playhouse Theatre, 9.30 showtime with Swing, Swing, Swing. Welcome on board, everyone. Cheers, Johnny. <laughs> So swing, swing, swing. We're gonna go yeah, see that, aren't we? We are. So yes. So as you can see, Paul's devoured. Is there any left? I don't know what you're talking about. What? I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. So yes. So um, we might just stay in our suite. We stay in our suite and watch Sail Away and sit on the balcony. No. No, because we're with you, you, Paul's dad and brother actually. So we need to be go go and be sociable. But 
If we weren't, I'd quite happily sit here, have a few drinks and watch the sail away from Southampton. And when I got back from my night around the ship, I'd ask her if she enjoyed herself. <laughs> Only for an hour. Anyway, let's go. Cheers. <laughs> right then, so let's tell you about our, our first night on the Spirit of Adventure. Um, after muster, we headed to get some food at the grill. We did. Which is on deck 12, um, and uh, with fabulous views as we were sailing out of the Solent, wasn't it? Um, and the food was just, well, your dad said, which I think sums it up. It's he's the a, best meal he's, he's ever had on a cruise ship. ship. It was. Service was impeccable. Um, tables were really well distanced, aren't they? And we like that. Yeah, no space. Yeah, um, easy access for Paul's dad on his mobility scooter. Uh, the food, we had snow crab and prawn and um, scallop for starters, wasn't it? Which was just delicious. We then had a Chateaubriand uh, beef dish that uh, was just cooked to perfection. Um, I then had... Um, I'll just have to start you on the Chateaubriand. Strangely, in the gravy, it had raspberries. raspberries. And you thought, and you're thinking, oh, like, well, that's got no place there at all. But it, but it, yeah, it, it, but it really worked. It didn't was. It? Yeah. Well, your brother Dean had um, a coconut and mandarin soup, a cold soup, and Dean's not very adventurous no, at, not all. at all. And oh my god, it was delicious. It was we all super, tried a bit. It was yeah. superb. Um, anyway, yeah. So the beef was cooked to perfection, wasn't it? Delicious. And then I had um, apple and blueberry crumble with Madagascar custard and it was just, yes. well, superb. Paul, you went for chocolate. Chocolate, yeah. <laughs> chocolate yeah. cake. So our first meal on board has been um, fabulous. Spectacular. Yeah. My father actually had the baked, he had baked haddock. Baked haddock. Roast, was, roast roasted haddock. Roasted haddock. Yeah. It was absolutely yeah. amazing. So very, very impressed with that. Um, so we just had the most amazing dinner, aren't we, in the, uh, the grill. And we've come down to the West Cape Bar just to have a drink before well, going Carol's to... Well, come to the West Cape Bar. What's it called? I've come to the North Cape Bar. <laughs> <laughs> so really, she should be somewhere else on the ship, but she seems to be sat next to me. Mm. We picked this bar because it's quite close to the theatre. We do. And we want to go and see Swing, Swing, Swing. Oh, yeah. Um, but we thought it'd be really busy, but look. Look we got here early. Yeah. Managed to get, managed to get a seat. It's, um... A fab bar actually isn't yeah. it but nobody here bar us yeah. which actually is quite nice isn't it well they've obviously our reputation precedes us mm, we've already met just a couple haven't we yeah uh, wayne and tracy at yeah. the lift we said we're going to the north bar if you want to join us they said now nah, you're all right no they yeah. didn't <laughs> been watching our iona vlogs they are. so if you're interested in going on iona then uh, i'll put a link above but anyway so um yes we're gonna have a beer here and then we're gonna go to the show swing 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 what she said. <laughs> then we went to the playhouse, didn't we, to watch the show called Swing, Swing, Swing. Um, we enjoyed it. It was great singing and dancing, but we did feel it was a bit dated, didn't we, Paulie? It was, it was very reminiscent of the show we saw on the Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, Cunard. And whether or not they're trying to sort of aim for that same sort of audience. But... You know, we didn't have any complaints about the singing and dancing, but it was just like... It was dated. It, 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 it was it from like the 40s and 50s. Yeah, it just seemed dated. I know, we prefer something a little yeah. bit more modern, but then yeah. everyone seemed to enjoy it, didn't they? Yeah. The, the playhouse was full. Yeah. So, um... Yeah, but so they, yeah. Locked, they locked the doors all over no, that it didn't. <laughs> And then we went to the Britannia Lounge. Now, the Britannia Lounge um, is right at the front of the ship, and it's a beautiful lounge, yes. isn't it? It's, we'll, sh we'll be taking you all around the ship during our, our vlogs and show you these fantastic spaces. Um, easy to get a seat, um, even though we are f sailing at capacity, yeah. we've been told. Um, no problem getting a seat. And there was Johnny, the cruise director, who's had us in hysterics already, hasn't he, with yeah, his he's, announcement. He's a funny, yeah. funny guy. Um, and he did some, well, some singing. And he had the whole crowd singing along, didn't he, with some <laughs> classics. Yeah. No, just going back to you said about some funny stuff when we were in the theatre. Carol does like to try and take a sneaky little yeah snap. pictures. And the announcement before the show from Johnny, the cruise director, <laughs> yeah. was: um, please note that if you do use any form of photography, we will take you outside and beat you to a pulp. <laughs> yeah. Which I thought was so I didn't take so there won't be any pictures of the shows, but um, but there we are because yeah. I didn't want to be. No, beat to, to a pulp. No. <laughs> but back to his show, 
Um, yeah, really good just singer. A good singer, plenty of banter, loads of people up dancing. Yeah, it was really good to um, see. A little bit of drunkenness by some people, but you know, <laughs> who, wouldn't leave, who wouldn't leave poor old Johnny alone? But, yeah, yeah but, there was a couple uh, of ladies that um, yes, <laughs> he was running it, away took from. Took a shine to him, <laughs> but a, a, a great show. And then and a conga. And a conga. We didn't right? expect to see a conga yeah. on Saga. <laughs> and then finished. The night was finished off by the Britannia House. Band. band who were very good, yeah. Um, yeah. four piece band, and they did all sorts, all sorts of stuff from Lionel, Lionel, Richie, Lionel Richie back to you know, Abba. Sort of, yeah, all sorts of stuff. Mm. All very, very good, and um, very pleased with our, yeah, we were. With our first. Service was excellent, they didn't have yeah. to wait for a drink, did we? It was no, really, not at all. it was great. So, we can't afford anything yeah. actually. Um, and we're loving our suite, aren't we, Paul? So, that's why we've just been chilling out our suite yeah. using the espresso machine, drinking all the complimentary little um. White lemonade. <laughs> I get excited about the most silliest of things. But look, we're in the English Channel, which we've just learnt from the captain is only 60 metres deep. There you go. Yes. I can't believe the car didn't know that. You knew that? No. No. So let's just show you our balcony, um, which is just superb. Look at this. And it's very calm, the weather, and we're day at sea today, and um, we're heading towards the Dover Strait, so we're slowly heading towards the Netherlands, aren't we? Yeah. Um, and it's just, it's not warm, but it's about 12 degrees, isn't it? But look, this is our favourite place, isn't it, Paulie, being at sea. So we're going to go and um, find Dean and John, aren't we, Paulie? Yeah. And um, we're going to go and grab some lunch, because we haven't eaten. Well, I've had some fruit from our fruit bowl. Because <laughs> in, in shock news just then, once again, we weren't up in time for breakfast. No, we slept really we, well. We just in, so comfortable. We're enjoying the sweet life. We are. We're going to get used to this, Paulie. <laughs> right, let's go. Join us in episode two, where we continue to enjoy this fabulous ship. <laughs>